トバルタンこんにちはクロアチア旅ソムリエのサチです今回はクロアチアの首都ザグレブで毎年6月から9月に行われるイベントザグレブタイムマシーンのうちアッパータウンインザパスについてご紹介しますアッパータウンインザパストは6月から9月の週末夕方5時から8時の間旧市街で行われるイベントですザグレブゆかりの歴史的人物に扮した人たちが気軽に写真撮影などに応じてくれます今回撮影をしたのは8月中旬のバカンストップシーズンザグレブが一番閑散とする時期で海辺夏休みに出かけたキャラクターもいて普段より少ない8組だけでしたがこの動画を最後まで見ていただくとそれぞれの歴史的人物が誰なのかが分かりこのイベントをより楽しんでいただくことができます8月中旬日曜日の午前中イエラチッチ広場の近くでコスプレをしたカップルに出会いましたインクロエーション100 years ago or even more people were saying for hello servus、uh-huh. and as ban yosipelachi the vice of creation yes it would mean something like your faithful servant so even from roman empire that was some kind of saluting way and germans also had this、uh, way of saying hello、uh, and we were part of、uh, austria hungarian empire so this German words stayed in Croatian like Serbus. There's a lot of German words in Croatian which we talk today.、Even. And this is the Viceroy of Croatia.、Uh, he was fighting against the、uh, Hungarians during the period of、uh, Austro Hungarian Empire.、Yes. So this youth would be、uh, Austrian military suit.、Uh-huh. Yes. And I am from the legend of how z a r e v g a t name. And if you saw on the main square, that's his square actually. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm.、Uh, if you saw the fountain, it's called Mandushevac. And I'm Manda. So、ah. the legend says how Manda was standing there with a jar and very thirsty Viceroy was returning from the battle. Very parched. <laughs> parched. And she was there taking water, grabbing water from the fountain.、Mm-hmm. And I was Mando Dusho. Mando Darling. Mando Darling. Grab me some water, Zagrabi mi vodi. Aha! And therefore, Zagrabi Zagreb and Manda Dusha. Manda Dushevac.、Mm. So, that's a little story that stayed in some stories, in songs, and so on. I am、uh, Banjelacic in the morning, but somebody else in the evening. <laughs> and who are you in the evening? I am、uh, Anton Gustav Matos. Ah, who is Anton Gustav Matos? A very famous writer from.、Uh, The beginning of the 20th century,、uh-huh. end of 19th, beginning of the 20th century here in Croatia. He was, let's say, a founder of modernistic style of writing here.、Uh-huh. And、uh, he was a very cool guy.、Uh-huh. But if you want to learn more, you have to come up there. y e l a c i c i Sotok, the Susumerale, the Nijobi, the Yugata, Zagreb, the Kyushigai, at the Kimasta. Kyushigai, the Cable Car, the Moikemasga, Sugu, the Nari, the Kaidan, the Kanta, the Nobremas. ケーブルカーを降りると目の前にはロトルシチャック塔この塔は毎日12時に鳴らされる大砲が人気ですが詳しくは別動画でご案内しますロトルシチャック塔横の通りの正面に見える聖マルコ教会の方へ向かっていきましょう右手にあるのは失恋博物館ですこちらも詳しくは別の動画でご案内します正面からコスチュームをつけた人がやってきました。あ。Uh, we f- fell in love, but、uh, I was a nobleman and she was a commoner, and we couldn't be together, everyone was against us.、Mm-hmm. So our love、uh, ends tragically. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Hello.、Uh, my name is Ludovic Gai.、Uh-huh. I was the、uh, 
on the on the forefront of uh, the battle for uh, making Croatian the official language. It was called the Croatian National Movement. Mm -hmm. It was in the 1850s. Okay. And my colleague is. And I'm the first Croatian opera singer, Sidonia uh -huh. Erdo Dirovido. And uh -huh. I'm very important because I sang in Croatian language uh -huh. for the first time. Okay. And he actually wrote the lyrics uh -huh. for the opera. Okay. Yeah. It was a big deal singing in Croatian because mm -hmm. uh, everybody sang in German. Then. Okay, so, uh -huh. and, and because she was royalty, uh -huh. she was of royal blood, nobody could boo her, nobody could say it wasn't uh, good or official. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So that's what really helped it. Okay, yeah. great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're welcome. Bye. 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 Matos, a writer, a poet, Bohemian, uh, born in the end of the 19th century, died at the beginning of the 20th. He's very famous here in Croatia. People tend to uh, think of him as the starter, founder of modernistic style of writer, writing. And uh, yes, he died very young of tuberculosis, which was pretty much the common cause of death at that time. Thank you. My colleague here. Maria Juric Zagorkam. Uh, I was the first female journalist and also one of the first feminists in Croatia. Mm -hmm. She was really um, an amazing woman back in that time. She was fighting for women's rights in Croatia. She had to write under a pseudonym because female writers didn't have rights at that time. And um, I don't know, she was two times in a jail uh -huh. because of that. She was the first one to smoke in public, to wear pants in public. Uh -huh. Yeah, okay. she was a pretty tough woman. Late 19, the beginning of 20. We were like... Com we were contemporaries, yeah. born in the same year, okay. 1873. Uh -huh. But we didn't really like each other. Yeah. <laughs> oh, really? Uh, I thought of her style of writing, it was pulp, uh -huh. pulp fiction, uh -huh. not very good. <laughs> I was more of a, let's say, a educated writer. Ah, uh, okay. While she wrote for... Uh, Common people, Common. like uh -huh. style of uh -huh. writing. Okay, I okay. help people to learn creation. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yes, uh, I even thought of her, I even thought that she looked like a man. <laughs> okay. She wasn't a really pretty, really pretty lady. <laughs> Thank you. You're, You're welcome. welcome. And you are? Uh, I'm a sand seller. I sold white sand. Sand? Yeah, yeah, sand, sand. sand. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah, yeah. But okay. not the sand you can see on the floor. This is the clean sand from the river. Uh -huh. which I would uh, collect in the village called Samobor, near uh -huh. Zagreb. Okay. And I would bring it here in my carts and I would uh -huh. yell on the streets, WHITE SAND! And uh, people would buy it uh, and it was used to clean the dishes. There was no detergent uh, in the okay, past, okay. so people used uh, sand to clean the dishes. Ah. And uh, also I was a, a handyman, I would uh, patch the 
dishes. The dishes were made out of copper and copper is really soft metal. You awesome. get like uh, holes often uh -huh. and I would patch them with a hammer. Okay, uh, okay. Or I would uh, patch umbrellas or clean the dishes if it's necessary. Uh -huh, so uh -huh. I'm like a handyman and a sand seller. Okay, great. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Welcome. <laughs> and Samobor is not the village. Uh, it was. <laughs> it was a village at that time. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really know. <laughs> we are a noble couple from the 19th century Zagreb. Uh, my name was uh, Ivan Borat, and this is my wife. I'm Sophie Zagreb. Uh, I, I was uh, the owner of the palace uh, called Vesta. Uh, my father was uh, a famous uh, master of trade. And, uh... we, I was much older than, than she was. When we got married, so she was very she was very sad because of that and because um, I was a, around, around. yes and because I was away most of the time. So to make her happy, my father built her uh, this very large ballroom inside the palace, and she was famous for throwing the best uh, the best balls in the in the city. Uh, after she died, as we didn't have any children, she left the palace to the city of Zagreb. So even today, it's uh, it's so no one lives there. It's uh, in the ownership of the city of Zagreb, but it, and it's only open for special occasions. Thank you. My name is Ladislav Belush. Uh -huh. I was the guy who brought this bike from the Paris uh -huh. in the 19th century, okay. and this was the first bicycle in Zagreb um, ever. Okay. Uh, also, I organized the first races around town. Uh -huh. uh, only four, to four participants uh, <laughs> were women. This is actually not a replica, so I shouldn't. But uh, yes, it is actually uh, not that hard for people to learn how to ride their own bikes when they were small, you know. Uh -huh. uh, and the reason why uh, everyone bo broke their bones was because they were heavy uh, people who fell from uh, this height. Uh -huh. uh, and it's actually not a problem when you fall down your own bike. Uh, when you're small, you know, uh -huh, because when uh -huh. you're this, this close to the ground, then uh, it's just not a problem. Okay, thank you. We're going to pull Zagreb time machine and mm -hmm. we start uh, at the end of April uh, till the end of September mm -hmm. or till the beginning of October. Mm -hmm. Every Sunday from 5 till 8 okay. in front of the St. Mark's Church. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. Welcome. Bye. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> ザグレブタイムマシンのイベントの一つ、アッパータウンインザパスト、いかがでしたでしょうか夏のザグレブではこの他にも、土曜日12時前後の衛兵交代式など、様々なイベントが行われています。夏の週末にザグレブを訪れることがありましたら、ぜひお見逃しなく。また、マイナス若干時期や曜日時間が前後する場合がありますので最新情報はザグレブ市観光局のサイトをチェックしてください今回ご紹介したモニュメントや博物館はこちらの地図でご紹介していますクロアチア旅ソムリエでは大人のためのクロアチア旅行お役立ち情報をお届けしていますこの動画がお気に召していただきましたらチャンネル登録して応援していただけると励みになります。最後までご視聴いただきありがとうございました。それでは次の動画までさようなら。フバーラ、トビジェニャン。